Uh, my name is Don Stith. I'm a tour guide here at Taliesin West. We're in Scottsdale, Arizona. Uh, this was one of Frank Lloyd Wright's great works. He came out here in the 30s and built this uh, in over th about three years, basically, and it is today a National Historic Landmark. It is a later uh, historic site that maybe we look at our early works more closely than some of the later things. These, these sites of this era are becoming more and more significant to architecture and the preservation of architecture. And so I would just encourage everyone to, to pay attention to our recent history because that is the, the, the works that are becoming uh, significant as we go forward into another generation and the works that we tend not to pay a lot of attention to because they're not really old as we say. These are significant. This is, a, this is a National Historic Landmark. Uh, Frank Lloyd Wright gave us 19 National Historic Landmarks. And you should know who Frank Lloyd Wright is. He was a probably, Ameri well he was, no question, America's greatest architect. If you ask him, he would say, why do you say America's? He would say he was the world's greatest architect. But that's a judgment call. I don't know if that was true or not. But he was a very important figure in our history. Uh, and in the way we look at our architecture, he, he designed what he called um, uh, Usonian homes. He did uh, what he called uh, uh, organic architecture. Uh, and they were beautiful works and were very significant over a 70 year period. So this is a type of architecture that would, would show uh, people today what can be done in later years, not necessarily centuries ago, but even recently, that are significant to our development as a country.